Hi, my name's Kerry Badham and I'm delighted to show you today the brand new FMM Entwined Hearts Cutter Set. We've used the Entwined Hearts to make a topper and we've got them standing up. So I made them, allowed them to dry and once they were completely dry, I supported them with a lolly stick. I've used the paper lolly stick because I could manipulate the shape to go in line with the hearts and then I've attached it with royal icing. So if we just come back down the cake now, I've made some ruffles here using the geometric circle cutter. Going further down, I've used the curved words, Mr and Mrs. And again, we've used the entwined hearts on the front of the cake this time. Just attaching that with water. The paste we recommend you use to make the topper on top of your cake would be a mixture of modelling paste and a mixture of flour paste or in some countries you call it gum paste. So you mix the two together and this will give it a nice sheen when it dries but it will also give it a lot more strength when you stand it on top of your cake. We've rolled out our mix of modelling and flour paste and we've turned it over so it gives us a nice smooth top. Then I've allowed it to dry for a little while so I've got a nice dry kind of edge on top of the cake. Then we place our cutter on top and we apply pressure with our hands. So you need to do this all over. And then we slide it. It's actually taking itself away. Slide it around your mat. This gives you a nice clean edge. Stops you from getting the frayed edges. But also you can see that your cutout isn't too thick. So now I use the palm of my hand just to rub over. And I'm just gonna pop these sections through. So it's falling out nice and easy, as you can see. So to remove it, you can tap it on your work mat and it will come out. Now, if you haven't left this to dry for long enough on top, what you might find is that it could stick inside. And if it does, you can slightly ease it out at the bottom here with your scriber tool. But as you saw there, I left mine dry for, for long enough on the side before cutting it out. So this had a nice dry edge. So when I tapped it on my work surface, it came out. So here we just turn it round. I'll just pop it back into shape because I've played with it a little bit. And then I just leave that to dry. So to attach it to the side of the cake, I would just attach that with water. The water will stimulate the Tylo powder in the modeling paste and in the flour paste, and it will become a glue. And to make it into a topper, I would leave that dry for at least 24 hours and it will be nice and solid. And then I can attach it to my cake in the morning. We hope you've enjoyed our video and we hope you like the latest edition of the FMM Entwined Hearts into our product range. Thank you for watching.